Good evening, developments in the news today. A congressman spoke today on how advances in space technology assist in medical science. Spin-offs from the space program will help save lives. And that's the news. I'm Carter Walkright. Darn you, Roger Maris. Hey, Ruth is so much cooler. I watched the movie. Anyways. See what the Soviets are up to. They're playing a lunar flyby. They tried a Mars flyby earlier, but I don't think it worked. The little computer has a lot more luck for some reason. Seriously. But I really can't do that much this turn, but next turn, I want a mission. I'm going to try something slightly daring. And try out a multi-step process. The one I was going for early, earlier, but decided to not go do it. I should assign some astronauts to that. So boys, you're getting pulled out of the Mercury program. Gotta break some crews up here. And Hurdle has a nice little one. Because she has experience in space. Or at least experience on the mission, I should say. And let's hit sign everybody to the Gemini program. They can get used to the craft. While I try to make it safer. And I should assign their teams. Now with this, we got two different positions. The pilot, who is also the docking specialist. And the LM pilot, who is also the EVA specialist. Roles will expand later on, but for right now, I'm going to send these two and my second crew. It'll be these two, and on my final crew. Hmm. It'll be these two. So they're actually in training for that particular capsule program. And I'm going to do assign them their mission. A man docking orbit EVA. This should end well. And those two are assigned there. And later on, I could purchase a second facility. I don't have enough cash right now. To do a second mission in the same time period. Obviously, I can't use the same crews. But until then, my budget increases, hopefully. Because the president hopes I get better. I hope I get better too. Until then. Good evening, developments in the news today. The Air Force has submitted to Congress a proposal for the Manned Orbiting Laboratory, or MOLE. The small two manned military observation platform would have a duration of 30 days. And that's the news. I'm Carter Walkwright. That's not happening for a long time. We're talking decades. Fortunately, the orange has nothing to do with your um, progress. It's just there for the historical. But historically, I have more money. Mega bucks! We don't have an actual money unit. But right now, I'm more into safety. And I don't mean the safety dance.
I should start a ranger program. No, I shouldn't. I should start probing. That sounded so wrong. What do you probe for? You probe the moon to try to find good spots to land. Learn more about the moon, because right now I don't know very much about it. Other than it is not made of cheese. So let's assemble some hardware. That's an awful old chance there. I can't use my atlas, because it's not strong enough to carry it. It can only carry 600 units, and a Jedi castle is a whopping 1200 units. Do I risk it? Absolutely! Also, I don't have a docking module. Oh well. I'm not gonna worry about that. I'll carry it with the next ship next time. So we'll do everything but talking. Anything else I should research? I need to get started on those modules soon. Seriously. And I'm gonna take a risk and start on the boosters. Because soon those rockets are going to be taking a lot more than a capsule. Although an alternative would to get be to get a second launch pad open and send the second rocket to carry the other heavy stuff and have joint missions. I'm serious. People don't explain this to you. That's why I do it. I've seen several videos on YouTube that do this but don't explain what they do. That's capsule trading. I'm not spending three megabucks to spend one person into capsule trading. So let's take a risk. With our Titan rocket and our Gemini capsule. And I could click through this for a click. Look through of each step. He repeated three twice, what the heck? And that is not a successful launch, people. That is a catastrophic failure. <laughs> oh my. I should have scrubbed that mission. This is not going to look good on my resume. When we come back, I'll get reprimanded by the president. And I went up K saying good night. And if you do send people into space, make sure the rocket fuel stays in the rocket engines. <laughs>